The following is an old update video regarding the text-to-speech series known as Microsoft Sam vs. Mac Alex. In case you haven't realized what channel this had been posted to, this is the Archives channel, where all videos posted here are re-uploads of videos that were previously posted to other channels, perhaps expanding to never-before-seen videos. Please see the description as to why this video got posted here. Greetings, I am the Ruffle Robot, and I will be here providing an update on Microsoft Sam vs. Mac Alex. I know that some of you are probably wondering where the next episode is. There is a lot to explain, so let's begin. Going way back to the production of the third episode. What you may not know is that some of it had actually started way back almost a few months after the release of Episode 2, around the 2009-2010 time frame. Episode 3 was put on hold for a while, mainly due to laziness and other personal stuff and I guess school could be another reason, but also due to the production of the revised first episode in 2011. Anyway, just about a month or two after the revised first episode was uploaded to YouTube, Cool Dude 503 started to work on the script for the third episode. He actually managed to write and complete the script within a short amount of time, unknown as to how long, and exported the audio files of the script not long after. The reason why the script writing for that episode was rushed was due to pressure of upgrading to Mac OS X line by a certain time, for reasons that Cool Dude 503 doesn't feel comfortable sharing here. Now, you're probably wondering, if that's true, then how come episode 3 took until March 2012 to get it uploaded? First and foremost, although it's most likely not the number one reason, at the completion of the scripting phase of episode 3, he didn't have Sony Vegas at the time. And secondly, it took him about a few months to get used to editing with it at the time. Primarily, it's probably due to laziness or some other reason. It's been a few years since then, at the time of writing this. Now, here is where episode 4 started going through production hell. Going back to where Cool Dude 503 upgraded his, now incredibly, MacBook from Snow Leopard to Line. When he took a look at the list of all the voices after upgrading to OS X Line, he saw that the voices that were there were the same exact voices that came with all Macs since OS X Leopard, at least with Alex. However, when he went through all of the voices after the upgrade, the speech patterns of the voices appeared to sound a bit degraded to him, even up to this day. This is where things start to go downhill from here. Cool Dude 503 was not completely satisfied with how the voices sounded, therefore, production for Episode 4 has been delayed. He was thinking about going the Hackintosh route for this, more specifically the Hackintosh version of Mac OS X Leopard, either on a different machine, or on a virtual machine, probably the latter. He's actually attempted to install Hackintosh three times, all of which have failed. Once, as a virtual machine on his MacBook, it didn't turn out so well, tried the same thing on the Mware player on his desktop PC, had no luck there, and even tried installing it on a secondary drive on said desktop PC. He actually did find an article on how to install OS X on the Mware player, however, he must have lost it, as that he apparently didn't bookmark it from any of the browsers that he uses between his tablet and computers. If there are any Hackintosh experts out there who can provide Cool Dude 503 a better solution, information regarding installing the Hackintosh version of OS X Leopard will be in the description below. Additionally, if someone you know that has an extensive knowledge in Hackintosh, ask that person on how Cool Dude 503 can get in contact, and he will take it from there. Examples of how the voices sound like will be provided at the end of this video to give you an idea. As for the script for the next episode, Cool Dude 503 had began writing it, actually, more like a rewrite, more on that in a bit, and actually finished writing the script. Here's the thing though. Some time after episode 3 was posted, he actually began writing the script for episode 4, however, long story short, that version of the script was stored on a flash drive that had been lost, even at the time this video was posted. The full story will be in the description, either that, or a link to a Google Docs document containing said full story due to the 5000 character limit. Even though Cool Dude 503 may have lost the original script for Episode 4, he actually remembered, roughly, most of what was in said script and, after a while, it had taken off. This is kind of a mildish spoiler, but, some of the ideas for Episode 4 ended up being in Episode 5. The reason for this is, because Cool Dude 503 pretty much went to town on Episode 4, and then realized that there was too much in its respective script. 
He felt that if he hadn't moved the excess elements from episode 4 to episode 5, episode 4 would probably, quote, drag on, end quote. So, in short, the beginning of episode 5 will contain the remaining ideas that were originally intended for episode 4. Another mild dish spoiler, Cool Dude 503 does not guarantee that the last episode of Microsoft Sam vs. Mac Alex will be episode 6, and it's very unlikely for that to be the case. For those of you who are a part of the text-to-speech community or were at least part of that community at around mid-2011, in a text-to-speech war series such as Microsoft Sam and the War in the Republic of Mai, and Microsoft Sam and the War in the Rough Island Chain, there are six episodes in each series. Those were one of the first text-to-speech war series that was posted to YouTube that we've come to know of today. However, those two series came out in 2011, and Microsoft Sam vs. Mac Alex originally came out at around mid-2009. Obviously, Cool Dude 503 didn't know how many episodes the series would have, and that still rings true to this day. For all we know, the last episode could be episode 8, or possibly episode 10. We'll just have to wait and see. Before I wrap up this video, there are some more things that Cool Dude 503 needs to get mentioned. Another spoiler, I promise that this is the last of the spoilers. Cool Dude 503 had established a new character, but he hasn't thought of a good name for this character. In the description, one of the lines from the script from episode 4 will be provided, however, part of it will be covered up so as to not spoil the episode. Hints will be provided underneath the line from the script. Cool Dude 503 will pick the best name for this character and will be credited in episode 4. Lastly, since it's been way too long since the last episode had been posted, Cool Dude 503 will be posting a preview of episode 4 to his text to speech side channel as a private video. If you want to see this preview, just send Cool Dude 503 a private message containing your email address. Sorry, that's just how sharing private videos work now. Blame Google, especially for those of you in the text to speech community. You can also give him suggestions for the unnamed character, as that it will be mentioned there as well. To wrap things up, as soon as Cool Dude 503 is able to find a way to get a Hackintosh version of OS X Leopard, he can almost guarantee that Episode 4 will be out sometime soon. Like I've said many times over, he knows it's been way too long of a wait between episodes, as that he's been working on this series since 2009, but in the end, it will probably be well worth it. He is almost certain some of you viewers want to get this series done and over with. Yeah, trust me, he wants this series to be done and over with as well, as that Microsoft Sam vs. Mac Alex will be the last text-to-speech series uploaded to this channel. The reason for this is, because his Cool Dude 503 TTS channel was launched in mid-2011, and, as mentioned before, the text-to-speech series originally started in early to mid-2009, which was about two years before the text-to-speech channel had launched. He felt that having to delete those videos and re-uploading them to the new channel would cause some confusion, same would go, if he ended up keeping the old episodes on the main channel and uploading all subsequent episodes on his text-to-speech channel. This is why he doesn't upload as many videos on this channel, not even non-text-to-speech videos, because he doesn't want people to think that he had totally forgotten about the series. As soon as episode 4 gets uploaded, this video will be deleted, and will be re-uploaded, and slightly edited, to the text-to-speech side channel for archival purposes. For those of you that are subscribed to Cool Dude 503 TTS, a video trailer for episode 4, and subsequent episodes as well, will be uploaded at least an hour after the main episode has been uploaded to Cool Dude 503. However, if Cool Dude 503 needs to be somewhere within an hour or so after the upload, or if the main episode is uploaded just before bedtime for some odd reason, he will announce it on Twitter. But anyway, thanks for watching, and have a great day. Microsoft Sam will never stop me. <laughs> My aerophilcopter goes up. 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 Flipping hell. I can't even make the aerophilcopter sound anymore. And I can no longer say aerophilcopter correctly. Well, it's no wonder why Cool Dude 503 has put the series on the back burner for so long now. Okay, kids. Behave yourselves. Or you will stay in the van, and your privileges will be taken away for a month. No way. They're very small. How can something small have a huge impact on us? Oh come on, trooper number two. We were about to pummel trooper number one right when you had to ruin it for us. Anyway, we need you back.
We can't go on without you because we can't stand the fact that we're rendered as stick figures under Microsoft Paint. Hey, trooper number two, calm down. There's no need for you to shout. 